everyone welcome back to my channel today I got some mail um, delivered to me um, I'm going on my vacation for a week to Santo Domingo in three weeks so I have done some uh, pre-shopping so this is the first pair of shoes that I got universal trend good corp cope I'm a size six and a half I'm actually a size six, but I got a six and a half because I thought it was going to be a little bit tighter. Um, so that's why I got the six and a half. But these are super cute. They are in style. They are beautiful. I love them. Um, they're just super cute. Really like the big bow. So let's try them on. I just really love um all these pearls so these are the other pairs i really like them you can wear them with jeans shorts anything i really love the pearls i think it makes it look very nice very classy very chic so i really really like them so this was 22 regular price 22.99 and i got 40 percent off so it came out to 13.50 um which is actually a really good price okay the red ones if i'm not mistaken they were don't have a price here but if i'm not mistaken the red ones were around 29 dollars so i got them for like 15 dollars or something like that i'm not sure but they think they're perfect for the summer um perfect to go on my trip and i just love them i am also waiting for a package to arrive in the mail today which is going to be the stroller that i am going to be using to travel um, this is a very easy stroller you just pack it up it folds and it's easy to uh, carry on the plane um, i had an experience last year when i went to dr we actually went twice last year and the stroller kind of got messed up so this time I had to buy a new stroller to travel to make it easier for me and Kylie. Um, being that Danny is going to be in DR and we will be traveling by ourselves until we get to Santo Domingo. Sit. Sit. Let's go. When you come home to packages, that is the best. Danny bought me this stroller um, so when we go to Santo Domingo um, in June which is in a few weeks uh, it will be just very easy for me um, when I'm in the airport especially that I'm gonna take a carry-on because you know we have to take almost everything over there just to be on the safe side um, so my old stroller like I was saying when we went last year we went twice we went in May and in June we um, took just a regular umbrella folder, uh, an umbrella uh, stroller, sorry. And that was, um, it was good. I still have it now, I still use it now. Uh, but the only thing is that in the airport, the people that took it out of the airplane kind of messed it up so it's a little bent. So this one is gonna be awesome because I don't have to wait for them to bring down that stroller. All I have to do is just get it fold it and leave or put it in my seat and then when I get to Santo Domingo it's just take it out and leave outside so I just got this package in the mail and I am going to open it so this is from GB pocket This is the stroller, and it's from GB Gold Pocket Future Perfect. Um, so that's basically how it looks. This is how it folds. So it's perfect uh, to put in the airplane. Uh, you can put it on the top, anywhere. I mean, it's it's gonna be very small. And this is how different 
you could do everything, you see. It's pretty cool, looking forward to it. I got it in black, I'm really not a big color person. Um, I think the other colors would have been a little bit too much and I don't like that. So I just got it black, very simple, and that's it. Alrighty, let's see how it looks. This is amazing. Look how small and compact this is. This is just amazing. I mean, this is gonna save me so much time. Oh my god, this is great. This is very small, very compact. I'm so excited. Now the question is, how do we open it? That's gonna be fun to see. How we get to open it. Okay. So I guess I have to read the instructions because it's not that easy um, to open. Okay, so preparation. Okay, let's see. Step one, we got it. To let's see where it's at. Here it is. Oh, awesome. Okay. Let's see. Let's move the camera around so you guys can see me. What I did was um, when you have it this way, there is a hook right here, and I just opened it. And that just opened the shoulder. Yeah. So it's basically just for me to go forward. Here we go. So that is basically it. So for me, it's great. There we go, that's more like it. Okay, yeah, because it was a little too small on the bottom, even for me, I mean, I'm sure for Danny this is gonna be great because it's good then. Um, let's see if Heidi wants to sit. Heidi, ven, mira. Oh, wow. Vamos a sentarte. I think Heidi approves. <laughs> You're ready to go on a trip, baby girl? Wow. All right, guys. So one of the things that's very important for me is that I am able to fold this shoulder back into that compact um, way that it came into that little square. I need to learn because how I am going to be traveling with Heidi by myself to meet Danny in Santo Domingo, I need to make sure that I can fold this in a one, two, three. That's the reason why I bought this shoulder. Um, I read the reviews and some people said that it was easy, some others said that it was a little hard, that they weren't sure if there was something wrong with the shoulder. So let me try. The first thing it says in the instructions, I need to make sure that the wheels in the bottom are locked into place. So, 
they need to be in the right direction in the right spot so i'm going to show you guys why it took me a little bit of time but i think just with practice it will be perfect so as you can see here in the shoulder it needs to show the right spot okay so if it's just to the side it would not lock okay it needs to be in the middle to bring it back up and just like that it locks the wheels will not turn and they're locked and that is the key part for it to fold down without a problem so once i got the wheels locked i need to bring this little visor back okay so it will be behind the shoulder now another thing that i need to do in order for the wheels to close correctly is i need to these wheels down here need to be bent backwards perfectly fine I need to close here and have it get hooked okay. so I finally got it to hook so I am just going to continue to practice to get it perfect. So I'm going to go throw away the garbage of Kylie, but I really think that she likes the stroller. This is how it looks with her sitting down. It's great. I like that it falls back a little bit when she sits there and she's not like sitting straight, but she's tilted back. So just in case she falls asleep, she could sleep well there and her head does not move. All right guys, so overall I really like this stroller. I think it's very lightweight. I just like how it is easy to move, maneuver even with one hand. Um, and Kylie seems to like it. Kylie, te gusta? Te gusta? Si? <laughs> I think it's perfect to travel. And we're gonna have some trips coming up, so. It's going to be the perfect stroller for us. please give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button and see my next video i just want to tell you guys thank you so much for always tuning in and i am going to be linking everything down below see you guys very soon good night